Hello guys. So today we're going to see how to return the JSON data from the action result. So normally we know that. Uh, so if you call the action, you can uh, um, uh, write the method like a public action result and whatever the type you want to return. You want to return the view or the partial view. You can do that. But how to do the uh, JSON re result uh, to be returned? So we're going to see today how to return a uh, simple JSON result so I'm not going to make it complicated so uh, for your understanding I'm just um, taking some small uh, returning uh, the uh, small variable okay so I don't want to waste your time so directly I will go and write my action result okay action result okay uh, I will call this as a service okay so service if I hit my service I I will get my JSON data so return JSON so we have the return type called JSON in this uh, you be going to return so return new okay in that uh, new mm, I am going to return uh, okay so name called uh, go free launcher and type YouTube channel so this uh, data uh, it's uh, give me uh, so I am asking uh, to return this data in a JSON format so that is what all about I'm going to do so let me uh, build my application and I'm going to hit my service so okay my application is uh, builded so it's uh, loading my page so directly I will go and hit my action so that action is seated in my home controller so that is what I gave the URL called home and the service let me go and hit that okay it asking that request has been blocked basic sensitive information because uh, please set the JSON request behavior to get method so because I'm trying to get a JSON result so I didn't mention the type uh, get type so that's what it's showing uh, throwing me the error okay so for that nothing uh, you need to pass one more uh, behavior so uh, my behavior is to get the request so JSON request dot behavior is allow get okay let me go and build again the application refresh the service yes so finally I got my uh, JSON result so the uh, the name uh, which I mentioned go freelancer and the type is YouTube channel so hopes you understand how to return the JSON types so this is the way you need to uh, do so in a future session uh, if I get a chance I will uh, um, update you how to return the dynamic uh, data into the JSON so I if I get a chance I will definitely show you that so you can try this same and uh, you if you want to go in the next uh, one more level uh, uh, to pause the model and how to return yes you can uh, that you can try by your own so thanks for watching the video guys if you have any doubt queries please comment us if you not subscribe our channel before please subscribe our channel